Electricity. It lights our homes. It powers our appliances. It keeps us in contact. Our very existence depends on it. But where does electricity come from and how does it reach us? First of all, it has to be produced or generated. There are many ways of generating electricity by burning fossil fuels, using solar panels, and through hydroelectric power. Most of Zambia's power is hydroelectric because of the country's many large rivers. The next stage is to transport the electricity around the country. This phase is known as transmission. Electricity is carried in power lines at very high voltage. The final stage is to distribute the electricity in a usable form. Each type of customer has different needs. The largest need lots of raw power. The smallest, such as a typical home, need far less, but at a much lower level to power household appliances. Mines, for example, are bulk buyers of raw power. They draw electricity straight from the transmission network and manage the distribution process themselves. For all other customer types, the electricity supplier, Zesco, manages the distribution. Smaller industrial users like factories, commercial users such as shops, malls and offices, and lastly, our homes all need progressively lower levels of electricity. The process of lowering electricity for distribution is called stepping down. This takes place at substations. You can find substations in most towns. Just don't go too near. As you can now imagine, getting electricity to our homes requires a lot of distribution infrastructure substations, transformers, and distribution lines. These all need to be built and maintained. Stepping down also results in energy losses, which can be as high as 20% in developing countries. The cost of supplying electricity, as you can see, is progressively more expensive the more infrastructure is needed and the higher the losses. The most expensive unit of electricity is therefore that which is received in our homes. A quick recap. First, the electricity is generated. Then it is transported around the country. Finally, it is distributed to customers. And we're right back to where we started. To find out more, download the short booklet, A Brighter Future by the Zambia Chamber of Mines. It's available free of charge at www.miningforzambia.com.